Hey guys, it's Aaron here from ASG Motorsports again, and we've got this very well-known R8 Club Sport wagon here on the dyno. Um, some of you would have previously known this car when Richie owned it. He sold it to, uh, to Cody, and uh, Cody's been having a play and getting out in this car and doing a lot of driving. During the course of all his street driving that he's been doing and on and off the property, uh, the motor needed a bit of a service. So we got the motor in and the car back in a little while ago, pulled the motor out to freshen it up. Subject to uh, availability issues with some valves from Ferrer, um, we've now had the car for a lot longer than we would have liked. But the valves turned up two weeks ago, we got the heads back together, dropped the motor back in the car, and here we are today just checking things out, making sure that everything's where it should be. We know that the car's made over 2,000 horsepower before. without any dramas. Um, we've got the race pipes on it now for Cody. The race bonnet's sitting there behind us, ready to go back on the car so he can start having a bit of a play. We've gone and changed a few things up in the car since Richie owned it for Cody. We've got a roll cage in there now, a couple of Kirky race seats, and um, we've upgraded the transmission, put a converter dump system on it so that Cody can get this car going and, and start to learn how to drive it at the Corralbon events. And once he gets a handle on it, we'll, uh, we'll get it down to the, to the racetrack at Willowbank and we'll see how the car actually goes over an eighth mile and a quarter mile on a radial. So um, yeah, we're really pleased to get good results again. The car's back to where it should be. Rolled out a nice, easy, lazy 1,650 horsepower at the wheels on 29 pounds of boost. Very rich, EGT's nice and cold and a super safe tune, ready for us to throw Cody in the seat and teach him how to drive this thing properly. So we'll give you a look at what we've done um, and we'll show you a couple of pulls on the dyno and hopefully uh, you'll see this car back out on the track soon so everyone can enjoy it. <laughs> 